Hey guys, welcome to TechZay Gaming. In this video, I am going to show you guys how to run Apex Legends on a low-end PC. Now, for this video, I downgraded my PC and this is what the specifications of my PC is right now. And you guys can see that I am using a GT730. Well, my plan for this video was to use integrated graphics card, but for some reason, my monitor was not working with the integrated graphics card, so I had to use this GT730. But after doing all the steps, I was able to get 60 FPS with all this specification. So so without wasting any more time, let's just get right into the tutorial. So first of all, what you have to do is go to the in-game settings and then go to video settings. Now from here, you will find the resolution options. Now in the resolution option, you will find that the least you can go is 1280 by 720, which isn't actually much less. But in the next step, we are going to go lesser than that. Then what you have to do is come down and get all the settings to lowest settings as possible. And obviously you can keep texture streaming budget to 2GB VRAM if you have a graphics card or using a laptop. But you can also disable it as well. After lowering down all the settings, you have to hit apply and then you have to close the game. Now after closing the game, you have to go to saved games, then respawn, then apex, then local, then video configuration file. And now you have to open this text file and look for this line. Now the line you can see which is setting.csm.enabled and you have to set the value from 1 to 0. Well what it will do is it will remove a lot of shadow from the game that are still available after even lowering down all the shadows and as you guys can see here's the before and after difference so there's a big difference you can see and this will obviously help in your PC performance. Now after that you have to find these two lines which is setting dot default res and, and another one is setting dot default res height and set the value to 960 and 540. Now after editing the file, what you have to do is save the file and close everything. Now after that you have to go to your graphics driver and then you have to enable the 960 into 540 custom resolution because if you don't have a custom resolution it will not work. Now your graphics driver might be different, it will not be Nvidia, it might be Radeon or Intel HD. Then in that case you will have to search on YouTube or Google that how to use custom resolution or how to enable custom resolution but if your one is nvidia or nvidia whatever you call you can also follow mine now after enabling custom resolution what you have to do is active custom resolution and then go into the game And after that, here's some gameplay footage and as you guys can see, I'm getting 60 FPS constant and the game is also playable and I played a couple of matches and I was getting really good performance. So guys, this is it for today and I'll catch you up in the next video.